In March 2015, Stirnerline launches the world's first vessel powered with methanol. Through the fuel change, Stirner Germanica's sulfur emissions are reduced to zero. But getting there has been a challenge. About uh, five years ago, uh, we started to look into this with a new sulfur directive that actually uh, came in place now for the 1st of, of January 2015. So uh, we were looking at uh, trying to find other alternative fuels and then we found that methanol could be one because that is a very big uh, commodity out in the, in the world. Well, methanol is, is a very clean fuel. It's, uh, of course, completely sulfur-free. So, so there is no problem with the new sulfur directive when you're using methanol. Uh, but also methanol is, uh, it doesn't come any suit when you are combusting methanol. So, so uh, you won't have any particles or smoke in, in the air. You have very low levels of, of uh, NOx also, which is uh, nitrogen oxide, which is also something that, that we have directives to, to follow and, and we want to minimize that. But, but another advantage with, with the methanol actually, but you can also produce it from, from uh, actually anything that, that uh, has a coal atom in, in it. Here at Chalmers, um, we're conducting a research directed to improve the catalyst which is needed to transform hydrogen and CO2 into methanol. We're testing our results in a pilot uh, company on Iceland. That's the, the first installation producing uh, methanol using only sustainable energy sources. Uh, I, I think the initiative uh, taken by Stena Wine is of enormous importance. Uh, I'm uh, um, totally convinced that uh, the experience and the example will be extremely positive with extremely positive impact on the development in this area. Uh, the advantages are enormous from a point of view of economy, from a point of view of environment, and from a point of view of um, development of the engineering science. We, we are uh, very proud, of course, that we are the first in the world to have uh, uh, a ship actually fueled with methanol. I think that methanol will, will uh, sooner or later become an important fuel for shipping and actually also for, for, uh, for transport as in large. Uh, and the reason is, is quite obvious and that is that, that it is uh, a simple fuel to produce and it is very environmental friendly.